Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do another installment of my Lipstick Roulette series. So I'm just going to start by showing you the lipsticks that I picked for last time and I'm actually going to switch it up today and I'm going to start with the lipstick that I'm actually wearing currently and that is this one from MAC which is uh, Pure Zen. Pure Zen is a really really nice nude on me. Uh, it looks awesome in the summertime. Uh, it is quite pale uh, on me but it still really suits my skin tone, but I would say that if you're much darker than me, this would probably w be way too light for you. Um, this is also a cream sheen formula, which makes it really, really comfortable to wear. And yeah, I don't have very many nudes in this shade in my collection, so I definitely want to keep this one. And that is pure scent on my hand right there. So next up we have one of my Chanel Velvet, um, no sorry, the Chanel Rouge Allure Velvet in the shade 46. This color is like a reddish, pinkish orange. It's really hard to describe. Um, I would say it's kind of like a muted red. Um, and it's really, really nice. This is also a color that I would wear more in the summer. Because it is more of a summery, corally red color. Um, I probably have similar colors in my collection. Um, and that's one of the things that I'm finding quite hard with this challenge. Is that instead of swatching all of the similar shades together. I end up picking similar shades at different points, which makes it really hard to compare them. But I know that this is a formula that I really, really love, so I will be keeping this lipstick. And that is the Chanel lipstick right there. So next in line, we have one of my YSL Glossy Stains, and this is in the shade 13. I'm very torn about these uh, YSL Glossy Stains. Um, I think they're really, really comfortable, but as you know, I'm not much of a a gloss person but these are definitely not sticky um, and they're just really really smooth on the lips I feel like these are very very comfortable to wear and, and they give off uh, a lot of color as well as gloss which I like um, I think they sit really nice on the lips and they last for a long time but I find that after a few hours they wear off and when they wear off at least this color it doesn't really wear off very evenly uh, so it sticks in certain places of your lips, which I don't find too flattering. But as with many other lipsticks, you would probably reapply some time throughout the day, so I don't think that's a major issue. So for the moment, I will be keeping this shade because I find that I like it a lot. Uh, but I know that I have a few of these that are very similar, so once I... Um, so once I pick another one of the glossy stains, I will probably come back to this one and look over which shade I prefer. Because as I don't wear glossy lips very often, I um, don't really need that many shades that are similar. But for now, I will be keeping this color. And that is the YSL glossy stain right there. So next up we have one of my ColourPop Matte X lip sticks, and this is in the shade Sauce. This color is very very stunning, and um, it's like a mauve purple. It is very wearable for being uh, on the purple family and that is probably because it leans a lot and um, more more than purple. Um, I really really like this shade and as you know by now this is one of my favorite formula lipsticks ever. So I will be keeping this one because I think it's stunning. Uh, although it probably wouldn't be a shade that I will pick for right now as it is finally getting warmer here. Um, and I gravitate towards these colors more in the fall and winter time. And that is the lipstick right there. And then the last lipstick that I have to share with you today uh, is this one, which is from Chanel, and this is another one of their Rouge Allure Velvets in number two. This was part of the Christmas collection, uh, I don't know if it was one or two years ago, um, and I picked this up and I absolutely love the shade. Um, it is the perfect, like, darker, more um, rich red, and um, I would still call it a red and not like a burgundy um, vampy color. It's just a super classy red that works super well um, when you want to wear something different than a bright red, and I absolutely love this color. And that is the last lipstick right there. So moving on to the second part of this video, and that is picking some new lipstick shades. Uh, and I'm just going to get right into it, and the first shade will be another one of my Colourpop lipsticks, and this is in the shade Gold Digger. And that is the first shade right there. And then the second shade will be another one of my MAC lipsticks, and this is a Costa Chic, and it's a coral color. And that is Costa Chic, very spring appropriate. 
So I'm sorry if the position of the camera has changed a bit. Uh, my camera just started, so I have to recharge that. Uh, and I'm going to continue picking the lipsticks. And I'm going to pick my third one right now. So it will be... Another one of my MAC ones. And this is Hue. And that is Hue right there. The fourth lipstick will be... This one, which is a mini lipstick from Smashbox. And this is in the shade Legendary. And that is legendary right there. And the final lipstick will be this one, which is another one of my uh, YSL glossy stains. And this is in the shade number 9. And that is the final shade right there. So that was all for today's video. I really hope you're enjoying this series. And um, if you do, please give it a thumbs up so I know that you're enjoying it. And yeah, I will talk to you in my next video. Bye guys!